New Year's is here, ladies and gentlemen. So is Bendy the Cage, new screenshots and teasers, but so is my cold. What is it, YouTube? It's your boys making pie here. So, let's jump straight into it. Bendy the Cage got an official Steam page. You can wishlist it right now. Link will be in the description. But we got four new screenshots. Let's go through them one by one. In this screenshot, as you can see on your screens right now, we got the same monster. He's holding that weapon and he's chasing us down. Now, y'all need to understand this, right? We, us, Henry, are a prisoner here, which we're gonna come to the lore in just a second. It has been revealed what the lore is. And we are trying to hide from this sucker right here. Now, we don't know the visibility of this sucker. We don't know how things are gonna play out. Obviously, stealth is gonna be a big part of, as always, for these bendy games. So, we're just gonna have to wait and see how the whole AI thing is. How creaking sound could alert him, if at all. Or if it's anything different. One thing is for certain, it is more focused on horror, so I'm assuming stealth is the key, rather than just the action that we've had in Battle. Battle had stealth, a lot of stealth actually, now that I remember, but still, I would not call it a pure horror stealth game. It was a mix and match of the two. But in the next one, ladies and gentlemen, we take a look at clean, absolute clean visuals. Now, I want to put on the screen Batam, the first one, and then Batar. And now this. As you can see here, they're really leaning into the more dark horror aspect of this. If it gives you Bioshock vibes, I don't blame you, ladies and gentlemen. But we are playing as Henry, we are holding that axe, and we've seen this place before. Why is this place familiar? We're gonna come to it in just a second, ladies and gentlemen. In the third one, Sammy Lawrence, ladies and gentlemen, is <sighs> back. And there's one thing that a lot of people might miss. If you zoom into the middle, you can see the plus sign this is the cross what do you call it cross ear basically the way you can aim and whatnot but anyways sammy lawrence is back ladies and gentlemen we've seen him in battle so it just made sense for him to be a big part here in bendy the cage you can see our ex is right there and it seems like we we were chased by sammy lawrence and we just made it into this whatever the cage that we are in get it bendy the cage i'll stop leave me alone yeah you see me because you're stupid that's right you don't know what you're doing, you understand me? There has to be a better way to get the ice off the car. I mean, I'm using a discount card, so I'm only getting 15% off. <laughs> And in the final one, ladies and gentlemen, we see more ink creatures, angry ink creatures. And there's now, now, really, like, really doing some mature stuff here. Not really. As you can see, in the first teaser that we got, we saw some blood on these ink creatures. Lost ones, as you would like to call them. The first creature had also blood on him. This lost one also has blood on him. True to the torture and pain and torment that they've been through here by whom you're gonna learn in just a second but as you can see we can block their attacks finally ladies and gentlemen as you can see henry is blocking the attack from this sucker right here and i hope we can add parry i've said this in a previous video as well i hope we add parry and that parry helps us do much more damage if that makes any sense but these are the five screenshots or four of the new ones you guys wondering okay smack you've been building up the lore here we go bendy the cage is a first person psychological horror game there you go i've said it bro i've said it that that takes place during the events of Bendy and the Dark Revival. So just before when Audrey met Henry in Bathar, it was very late in the game, by the way. So at the time, Audrey is running around, and I really hope we see through the you know sneaky peeky into the Bathar thingy where we see Audrey jumping around and what, not fighting Ink Demon and whatever. It also says here the shadows are closing and fight the madness before it's too late. But you guys wondering, Smack, who are we fighting against? Well, Bendy the Cage is the fearful story of Henry and his escape from the Keeper prison known as the pit there you go keepers they're finally getting an extended lore i've said this previously when i was making battle videos as well that the keepers were far better replacement of the projectionist uh -huh. projectionist 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 huh why can't i say the word projectionist had so much potential but the keeper was uh, you know it just a lot it was a lot more intriguing than projection i'm just gonna give up on that the darkest souls have been banished to this deep hellscape of metal and blood it was literally showing as you can see a lot of metal on the heads of these lost ones and also blood survival will require you to fight the madness before it devours you whole now understand right this is a psychological horror game we know that henry survived he met audrey that's not the point of this game we can think of this as a pathos which was boris and the dark survival but bigger because consequentially we're only learning the lore of what we've already knew 
but just this will fill in more blanks. And yes, it is dropping in 2024. I cannot believe some of y'all were saying it's gonna drop in 2025. What is what, what is the matter with you, bro? This is not the third mainline game. It is a, it is a main game, yes, but it's not the third main game as many would think. It is a, there's gonna be a long time before we get to that. Susu for more, ladies and gentlemen. Are you excited for Bendy the movie? Because I know I am. 100k, let's go, boy.